Good morning and welcome into my kitchen here in my home. One of the common questions I get uh, is what's your morning routine like? And when I first get up, I have that quiet time and I pray. I then get a good workout in first thing in the morning and then it's time to eat and fuel your body properly. So today to answer your question on what I eat, six days out of seven, I wanna share with you my morning routine and nutrition. Three eggs, just a touch of sea salt. Always yummy, yummy. And then measure it out. One cup whole grain oats, right on in there. Stir that bad boy up. Gotta love eggs and oatmeal, staple breakfast. Okay, great protein with the eggs. You got the oatmeal working here. I like to get a little bit of trick, a little trick I learned from Strong here when I was on Strong. Put a little water. Get a little sizzling, a little bubbling on the outside. It's going to fluff up nice. Add a little texture to the eggs. Get that going. Ooh, it's going to be a yummy breakfast this morning, baby. I also use whole butter in here. Butter in here, uh, following more of a ketogenic type diet. I'm not afraid of butter. I'm not afraid of eggs. I'm not afraid of good fats. Good fats are actually going to uh, improve your nutrition, improve uh, your whole mindset, and get your brain chemistry right. So uh, that's how the eggs are typically done. And of course, the oatmeal just takes a few minutes and be ready to rock and roll. So in under 10 minutes, my breakfast will be done and I will be eaten. See the little happy face. He's happy. Don't eat a lot. You don't need a lot. All right, final preparations. Let's bring it over to the uh, center console here. So let me bring you through it. First thing first, I'm an East Coast guy. I love ketchup on my eggs. So got to have a little ketchup all over the eggs. Boom, boom, boom. Get the ketchup. Ketchup's done. Now let's go to the oatmeal. Couple things with the oatmeal. This is where the oatmeal really gets good. And sometimes I'll just do oatmeal if I'm in a rush. So first thing I'll do, I'll take a little bit of the Manuka honey. Oh, Manuka honey, the finest honey out there. About a half, half a tablespoon of the Manuka honey. Oh, it's going to be good. Next, I sometimes will use a protein shake after my workouts or I'll put it in my oatmeal. So all I'll do here, this is a whey, okay? Uh, this is my ascent, boom. Half a cup up to a full cup. Stir that bad boy around. It's going to be a little sticky in the beginning. Take a little bit of almond milk. I like almond milk. You want almond, regular milk, go for it. I'll put some regular milk in that. So now I have oatmeal. I have whey protein in the morning. I'll have some casein at night. But the whey protein, look at that, how it assimilates right into the oatmeal. And then after your Manuka honey, natural sweetener goes in there, I've got my fruit. Cleaned up the fruit. I love fruit. You're like, oh, I've heard not to eat fruit. Hey, if it once had a mom or a dad, once had a life, it's a good thing. Fruit once had a life. Look at that. Isn't that a beautiful thing? Right there, got the fruit and nuts. Okay, almonds, slivered almonds, and my favorite, you don't need, a, you don't need much, walnuts. If it looks like a brain, it's a very healthy food. And walnuts look like a brain. So load that bad boy up with walnuts, my friends. You are set to go with your eggs and your oatmeal. Take a look at that. There's the ingredients. Lastly, a couple of things I do for my morning routine, a little secrets. I'm letting you in here into the domain in the morning. My wife and kids know like, hey, when dad's cooking, like this is my area. All right, let me show you a couple of things. I'll do a quick little teaspoon of this bad boy, cod liver oil, mm, fish oils. Oh, it's good. Mm. Cod liver oil. Sounds, be sounds bad? The best. Apple cider vinegar. Like, never heard of that. What's that all about? Lots of good things, especially in the morning when you wake up. I go straight up. Man up. Ah, matter of fact, if you're acidic, you could put a bunch in there. Ah, even better. Great for digestion, great for the stomach, great for clarity of your brain, uh, good for cholesterol good for blood pressure. So uh, you can put that on your salads. You can do it straight up, however you want to. I do two a day, two a day. Hint. Lastly, okay, on this, I told you I put my protein into my oatmeal. I have my Keto OS. I shared earlier I do more of a ketogenic type diet. One of these, okay, 
One keto OS right in there. Exogenous ketones. I started this when I was on strong. And let me tell you what, it transformed not only my body, uh, but also helped arthritis in my knees and most importantly, my brain chemistry, getting the mind right. So the fact that I got my meditation, got my prayers in this morning, got my 45 minute workout, and now this looks all extravagant. Folks, this took less than 10 minutes uh, to make all this. Mm. Mm. Love this right here. So there you have it. You have fresh fruit, you have eggs, great protein, you got your oatmeal, you got fresh fruit, you got some of your nuts, and uh, a couple of my, my secret supplements that I use to help fuel the body. Why do I share this with you? Because I want you at your best. And it starts with training hard, it starts with eating right. And when you go inside my kitchen, this is what I do. And invest in yourself and all that you do and how you take care of your body, because you only got one of those things. And it's said that he or she who has their health has a thousand dreams. He or she who does not has one. Hippocrates said back in 400 BC, and by the way, Hippocrates used to use apple cider vinegar. He talked about let your food be thy medicine, thy medicine be thy food. So let your food be thy medicine and let it fuel your body. So there you have it from inside the Durkin household here. Uh, thank you for stepping into the kitchen. I got to eat and then always don't forget, fellas, don't forget to do the dishes. Have a great day. Peace. We out. All right, time to go, baby. <laughs>